Hello everybody, my name is Vinay Jacob John. Please visit my three gospel websites, jesushealsministries.org, prayingtongues.org and also peopleofjesus.org. Today we are going to read about thoughts and how to think right according to the word of God, Jehovah Jesus, Holy Spirit. Proverbs chapter 23 verse 7 For as we think in our heart or soul, which is mind with emotions, so are we. Second Corinthians chapter 10 verse 3 For though we walk in the flesh, we do not war after the flesh. For the weapons of our warfare are not common, but mighty, mighty through God, Jehovah, Jesus, Holy Spirit, to the pulling down of strongholds in the mind, casting down evil imaginations, and every high evil thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of God, Jehovah, Jesus, Holy Spirit, and bringing into captivity every evil thought to the obedience of Christ Jesus and having in readiness to revenge all disobedience, then your obedience is fulfilled. Ephesians chapter 6 verse 10 Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord Jesus and in the power of Jesus' might. Put on the whole armor of God, Jehovah Jesus, Holy Spirit, that we may be able to stand against the wiles of evil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Therefore take unto you the whole armor of God, Jehovah Jesus, Holy Spirit, that ye may be able to withstand in the evil day, and having done all, to stand. Verse 14. Stand therefore, having your minds girt about with truth, and having on the breastplate of righteousness, and your feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Verse 16. Above all, taking the shield of faith wherewith ye shall be able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked, and take the helmet of salvation, and the sword of the Holy Spirit, which is the word of God, Jehovah Jesus, Holy Spirit, Jesus Christ. Verse 18. Praying always with all prayer and supplication in the Holy Spirit, and watching thereunto with all perseverance and supplication for all saints. Verse 19, And for me also, that utterance may be given unto me, that I may open my mouth boldly to make known the mystery of the Gospel. And also Philippians chapter 4, from verse 4. Rejoice in the Lord Jesus always, and again I say, Rejoice. Let your moderation be known unto all men. The Lord Jesus is at hand. Jesus Christ is coming soon for us all, to take us back to heaven. Be careful for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known unto God, Jehovah Jesus, Holy Spirit, and the peace of God, Jehovah, Jesus, Holy Spirit, which passes all understanding, shall keep your hearts, spirit man and mind, soul, mind, with emotions and body, in Christ Jesus. Verse 8. Finally, brethren, whatsoever thoughts are true, whatsoever thoughts are honest, whatsoever thoughts are just, whatsoever thoughts are pure, whatsoever thoughts are lovely, whatsoever thoughts are of good report, if there be any virtue and if there be any praise, Think on these things. Thank you for listening to me today. Jesus loves us all. Jesus heals us all. Jesus provides for us all. Always. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen.